The Breeze, a proud broadcaster in high definition. In living color. And we're starting fresh with the Nintendo 64 version of Jeopardy. My cat Tiger comes into the room. Hey Tiger. Ready to know what boxes again. Easy questions only because this is game one. And now, here is our host, Alex Trevet. Welcome to your favorite game of answers and questions. We know who the contestants are. So let's go to work in the first round, the Jeopardy round, which has the one daily double. Category R. Going to be dealing with odds and ends. Oops, careful. Geography. Famous names. Astronomy and space. English literature, and finally, Europe. Make a selection. I'll take odds and ends for 100. This preserved cabbage dish has a German name, but the Chinese invented it. What is sauerkraut? Right. Select again. I'll take odds and ends for 200. In 1985, a statue of this huge elephant was erected in St. Thomas, Ontario, where he died 100 years earlier. Ooh. Money rings in. Oh, Jumbo, that's right. That's a correct That was my one. guess. Make a selection. Astronomy in Space 100. The largest of these on the moon appear to be of meteoric origin, the smallest ones of volcanic origin. What are craters? Er, no. No, what are mountains? I changed my mind. What are mountains? No. I'm going to change my mind again. What are craters? So that's the correct Yay. Make a selection. Astronomy in space for 200. In 1994, this country launched its first domestically designed and built rocket from Tengashima Island. Tengashima Island. What is Japan? You got it. Yay. Like Astronomy in space for 300. To the disappointment of many Star Trek fans, this first shuttle never went into space. I think I know, but I'm not too sure. It's the Enterprise. Again. Okay, astronomy in space 400. This orbiting telescope is controlled by radio from the Goddard Flight Center in Maryland. I don't know this one. Does Jen? The Geos? Wrong. Wrong. Anyone else? Does Marty know it? The Hubble. That's right. Yeah. Make a selection. Odds and ends for 300. Annual events in this state include the Maple Festival in St. Albans and the Marlboro Music, Marlboro Music Festival. Ooh. What is Vermont? And that was my guess. That's right. Yeah. Make a selection. English literature 100. His friend Edward Bulwer Lighton convinced him to change the original ending of Great Expectations. Who is Charles Dickens? Not 
Charles Darwin. Charles Dickens. That's right. Make us a Angel Soler tried 200 plays. The poet who wrote, Ye flowery banks of bonny, of bonny dew, how can ye bloom so fair? Who is Robert Burns? That's right. So I think English literature 300. John Bunyan said this book will direct thee to the Holy Land, if thou wilt its directions understand. What is the Bible? Sorry. No. Anyone else? Crap. Does Madi know it? What is the... Let's go Israel? Wrong! No, that's incorrect. Anyone else? Jen is going to try it. The Pilgrim's Progress. Oh. You got it. Make a select. Famous name 100. This leader of the Untouchables later cleaned up Cleveland, Ohio. Uh, who is Corey Lawrence? Oh wait, if it's Ohio, then who is Michael Batten? Uh, no, that's wrong. Well, Maddie rings in. Elliot Ness? That's right. Yep. Make a selection. Odds and ends for Derived from the Italian for nephew, it's favoritism shown to nephews or other relatives. I don't know. Body brings in. Family values? Wrong. No, that's incorrect. Anyone else? Wrong. 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 Nepotism. Nepotism. Make a selection. Uh, astronomy space coming here. Laika, the first canine cosmonaut, flew aboard the second of these Russian satellites in 1957. What is Sputnik? You got it. Yay. Make a selection. Odds and ends, 500, please. Hippology is the study of these animals. What are horses? I'll take the English literature for 400. He wrote his 1742 novel, Joseph Andrews, in imitation of the manner of Cervantes. Who is Ready Unknown Fox? No, that's incorrect. Of course that's incorrect. I was just being a smart aleck. Does Marty know it? Who is Thomas Hardy? No, sorry. Wrong! Anyone else? But because I said ready and known thoughts, you can red next bank me if you want. Henry Fielding. Pick again. Ow! English Literature 500. Her novel, North Hanger Abbey, is a story of a gothic novel fan who has a wild imagination. Who is Flusters? Australian for beer. Not even close. Ow! Jane Adams? No, Jane Austen? That's right. Yep. Make a selection. Famous names for 200. The site of this last day in soldier's home is now the Monroe County, Michigan Historical Museum. Who is George Armstrong Custer? You got it. Famous names for 300, please. After he became a magistrate in Car of Carthage in 196 BC, he went into exile to avoid being turned over to the Romans. <laughs> Anna. 
Hannibal. That's kind of my hunch. Famous name is Warner. This defender of Scopes was once tried and acquitted of attempting to bribe a juror. Um, who is Eighth of Almighty? Wrong. Well, Jen rings in. Henry Clay? No. Gosh, that's wrong. Anyone else? Clarence Darrow. Make a selection. Clarence Darrow. Fair to say, 500, please. In 1980, 125 were injured in protests coinciding with her investiture as Queen of the Netherlands. Who's that one queen whose name I can't think of? Beatrix. Make a selection. All right. I'll take geography for 100. Jordan borders this sea that's seven times saltier than the ocean. What is the Dead Sea? You got it. Geography oh, tour. Only 1% of the land of this country between Russia and China is arable. What is Mongolia? Right. Geography 300. Select again. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Eritrea is located on the part of Eastern Africa known as this. What is Ethiopia? Sorry. No? Anyone else? The Horn of Africa. Think again. They wanted the region, not the country. Geography 400. The fertile plain east of the Danube, making up half this country's area, is called the Great Alford. What is Hungary? That's right. Um, 500. Geography 500. South American capital that's closest to the... South American capital that's closest to the equator. What is Quito, Ecuador? You got it. Yeah. Again. We know the daily doubles in Europe. Is it in the hundred dollar clue? No. On January first, 1979, this country created the Canton of Yora. What is Switzerland? You got it. Two hundred. Select again. This rocky site is known as the key to the Mediterranean. What is the Rock of Gibraltar? Or just, what is Gibraltar? You got it. 300. Select again. The Daily Double. I'm feeling good. The Danish national one is the Denebrog. Brog for Old Danish, Brog being Old Danish for cloth. The Danish national one is the Denebrog being, Brog being... Old Danish for cloth. What is the flag? That's a yeah! At fifty six hundred, you're at four hundred. To the French, this country is Almain. What is Germany? I took a lucky guess on the deadly double, and it paid off. You got it. Last clue. Albert II has been king of this country since August 9th, 1993. I'm going to take a guess and say what is Spain? No. 
Sorry, wrong. Anyone else? Not King of Spain. Had to go northern. Belgium. All right, it's oh, well. now for the double Jeopardy round. But I have a big lead right now. 5,500. Body has play. 200. Or no, body has 100. Jen minus 200. Categories for you are as follows. Double Jeopardy, we're going to deal with the 16th century. Artistic quotes. Baseball history. 1776. Food and drink, and finally, 70s films. Make a Food and drink, 200. Yaman de Asturias is a famous Spanish type of this meat. What is... What is this, chicken? No. Sorry, wrong. Anyone else? Rats. Does Jen know it? Ham. That's a correct oh, course. Of ham. Like again. Baseball history 200. It's in 1954, the St. Louis Browns moved to Baltimore, becoming this new team. For the Orioles. Right. Make a selection. I'd like 70 films for 200. Besides directing this 1974 film, Roman Polanski played a gangster who cut Jack Nicholson's nose. What is Chinatown? That's right. So I begin. 70 films for 400. Film in which Peter Finch yelled, I'm mad as hell and I'm not going to take it anymore. What is network? That's right. 70 600. Oops, 800. David Carradine starred in Bound for Glory, a 1976 biography of this folk singer. I actually picked the $800 clue, but that's okay. I think I might know this. Uh, who's Woody Guthrie? You got it. Now the $600 clue. Select again. Marlon, Bla Marlon Brando received $3 million to play Jor-El in this 1978 film. Superman. Yep, what is Superman? I've seen the movie before. Good movie. Right. Let's call about 70 right, yeah. films. Murder on this train, a Hercule Poirot mystery, took place during a journey from Istanbul to Paris. What is the Orient Express? That's right. Select again. Uh, baseball history for foreigners. In 1905 and 1906, this American League team was known as the Boston Pilgrims. Who are the Pittsburgh Pirates? Or... Is it the Boston Red Sox? I'm going to change my mind and say, who are the Boston Red Sox? Right. Good thing I did. Like again. Baseball history, 600. The oldest man to hit 400 was this Georgia Peach, who accomplished it in 1922 at age 35. Don't remember this one. Does Jen know it? Ty Cobb? That's the correct response. Yep. Make a selection. 16 for 200. Years after finishing this painting project in 1512, Michelangelo still suffered pain in his neck. What is the Sistine Chapel? That's right. Make a I'll take artistic quotes for 400, please. Or no, no, that's not artistic quotes. 16th century, 400, please. On the night of June 30th, 1520, he barely escaped from rampaging Aztecs at Tenochtitlan. Who is Hernan Cortez? That's a correct response. 60 oh, for 600, please. This English queen of nine days was beheaded February 12th, 1554 at age 16.
I'm going to say it was um, Anne Boleyn. No. Okay, I'll change my mind again. Mary Queen of Scots? No, sorry. No. Anyone else? Lady Jane Grey, where are your manners? My manners are down your toilet and into your sewer. Oh man, 16th century 800. He studied for the priesthood in France, but became a Protestant circa 1533 and later moved to Geneva. Who is Martin Luther? No, sorry. No. Does Jen know this one? John Kevin. No, John Kelvin. That's right. Make a selection. Food and drink for Henry. Jam is made from fruit, while this related spread is made from just the juice. What is jelly? Right. I'll take food and drink for 600, please. The Mediterranean life form variety of this is a better producer of eggs than meat. What is protein? Sorry. No. Anyone else? Jan rings in. A chicken? Right. Oh. Make a selection. Baseball history is Only two pitchers have over 400 major league wins. Walter Johnson and this man for whom a pitching award is named. Who is Cy Young? Right. <laughs> Make a selection. Baseball history a thousand. Uh, let's see 1300. Both the Mets and the Yankees retired this manager's uniform number. I don't know. So I'm saying who is Yogi Berra. No, sorry. No. Casey Stengel. Make a selection. I'll say food and drink for 800. This Scottish national dish has been described as a sort of paleolithic sausage. Ooh. Does Mommy know it? Had Haggis. Oh, yeah. You got it. Make a selection. 1776 for 200. This northern California city was founded as Yerba Buena by the Spanish in 1776. And Mati rings in again. San Francisco. That's a correct response. Yep. Again. Artistic quotes, 200. Someone said of his, the last judgment, such things might be painted in a voluptuous bathroom. Who is that parenticitis methane? <laughs> Which means I'm not even close. It's Michelangelo. Keep going. So, or no, food and drink for a thousand. The name of this root used to make tea comes from the Chinese gentian, translated as man root. What is Newkirk G Man 2? No. What is cinnamon? No, that's not right. Wrong! Anyone else? Ginseng. Ginseng. Pick again. Artistic quotes 400. Miro called this mobile sculptor the tough guy with the soul of a nightingale.
I don't know. But does Marty? Alexander Calder? That's right. Yep. Select again. 1730, no. The 16th century for a thousand. This bridge that crosses a narrow part of the Grand Canal was built at the end of the 16th century. Ooh. I don't know this one. Does Jen? The Bridge of Sighs? No, that's not. No! Jen loses all her money. The Rialto Bridge. Again. Okay, now we're going to 1776 for 400. Now famous for its cliff divers, this Mexican city was destroyed by an earthquake in 1776. What is Acapulco? You got it. 1776 for 600. Oops. He published an inquiry into the nature and causes of the wealth of nations. Who is Adam Smith? Right. Make a selection. The other end of the double is an artistic point from 600. So I'll measure 300. Okay. John Singer Sargent supposedly said, Every time I paint this type of work, I lose a friend, and it's a portrait. You got it. Stevie Smith wrote of this artist, See how Theo Tocopoulos throws on his canvas colors of hell. It's El Greco. Thank God said of this American Impressionist, I will not admit that a woman can draw so well. Who is Patrick Butler? That's definitely wrong. 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 It's Mary Cassatt. Mary Cassatt. This Bahamas city, named for William III's family, was held briefly by American revolutionists. What is Freeport? No. Gosh, that's wrong. Anyone else? Nassau. Oh well. Take again. On July 4th, 1776, the Congress appointed Adams, Jefferson, and Franklin to design this emblem. What is the American flag? No, sorry. No. Anyone else? So I finished with $6,000. The right answer is the Great Seal. All right, players, start thinking about your wagers for final Science. based on what you know about this category. Okay. Maudie would go up to $3,000, so I'm going to bet $2,900. I should go up to $3,000. Yeah. $3,000. Nine hundred, two thousand, nine hundred, ninety-nine dollars. Yep. And your final Jeopardy answer is... The body's main artery, it extends from the heart to the fourth lumbar vertebra. What is the...
What did you put down as your response? No, I'm sorry. The that's jugular, wrong. that's wrong. The aorta, I got it right. So did Ma uh, Monty. You got it. So I have a one game total of eight thousand nine hundred ninety nine dollars, and a run gets to begin. Thank you for playing Jeopardy. Let's do it again real soon. We shall. Almost nine thousand dollars in one game. I'd call that a victory. video coming soon.